It's just that. See, this don't show like if, if it's if it's going or not. It don't show no timer, no nothing. I thought that's it showed on hers before. Yeah, oh. that's blurry as hell. That needs to get cleaned on. Hey, hey y'all, hold on a second. We we we. You know, I've been begging this dude to upgrade this phone. It just needs to be cleaned off. Mine never needs to be cleaned off. Yours needs to be cleaned off all the time. That's all the wacky wacky you be doing on your phone. <laughs> get, get juice all over the place. Settle down. Get that motherfucker a break. Right. Is yours in the right place? <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Come sit down and I know for sure. Here we go, y'all. It's still a little blurry. <laughs> it's way better. Right. Oh, no, it is real. Uh, look, ain't nothing I can do about it now. Yeah, it's a wrap. Hey! 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 This is the Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. Episode of the Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. We are back live. Full of that, y'all. What's happening, Murrah? What's going on, everybody? Appreciate everybody that comes to and supports Keisha, us. Keisha, Keisha, whoop, whoop. Every week. I'm trying again on this uh, Instagram. I absolutely do not know what I'm doing on Instagram, so you know what I'm saying? So uh, it may be playing. It may not. <laughs> You know right, you got to give it. A, you got to do a couple test runs. I do, I do. I just did you push that it. the white button? The white. I pushed it. It used to be a different color. Push it again. Huh. Huh. Okay. All right. Disclaimers. Just gonna leave it. If there. you uh, hear any music, we do not claim to uh, have the rights What's to up? sad music. It's just some background Mara. stuff playing. Uh, Mara. Since I ain't seen you in too long, glad to see you in. You know, you can always drink with me. I know how and you get Ned, down. Hey, Tommy. Uh, Tommy. Tommy. Tommy and Tony. On, What's happening? Tommy and Tony. Again, we appreciate y'all coming and checking us out for the latest episode of the Voters Bourbon Broadcast. The Voters Bourbon Broadcast. If you'd like to make a donation to the show or sponsor a week, uh, have us get a particular bottle that you want us to try out, feel free to hit us on the cash app at cash tag. That's the dollar sign. Q-U-I-C-D-O-G. That's Q U I C D O G. Q U I C D O G is the cash cash app. Hit me there. You can make the donation, make the uh, the sponsorship. We'd appreciate that. Uh, any amount of help, but if you want us to get a bottle of Louis the Thirteenth, you got to get Louis the Thirteenth money. Nah. Don't send in five dollars talking about get that Louis. Louis. <laughs> I got five <laughs> on that Louis. Donnell. Donnell. What's up, Yo. brother? And thank you to all the sponsors who have sponsored yes. thus far. We are uh, about a year and a half in, and this has been going great. Y'all been you hooking to, us up, man, y'all been blessing us. To each and every one of you who come through week after week, we appreciate your, your, your Black eyes. Jesus <laughs> and white Jesus. They both are eyes. We, <laughs> we appreciate y'all hooking up the show, making making, right. making a good part of it. So Coco said she'd be in today. I know some of y'all was like, yo, I like her, but if she, if she was coming through, she might be here in a few minutes. She so. made it. She, she always made it. Let's hope so. <laughs> Yours look all clear and it's because I got a, a phone that was made. Hey man, the last decade. shut your ass up. <laughs> you know what I'm Yours been through the war. <laughs> <laughs> it's all it is kind of it's like if we a dream on my screen. You over here using a flip phone to do this. <laughs> it, it barely supports the dog on apps. Yo, man, man. I'm ready to get to this. Look. Well, Bless a, this real quick. Give me just this. Uh, and then uh, start opening and pouring. Y'all, today we have um, a drink that was first introduced to me when I was in Atlanta by the homeboy Black Guru. Uh, I was just texting him a minute ago. Hopefully he had come through. But he was like, yo, you got to check out this Chattanooga. It is really good. I think you're going to like it. But I didn't wasn't able to find it here in Chicago. Then I went to Atlanta and, you know, he was there. We all met up down there. And, uh, yo, I checked it out. And I ain't going to say what I thought about it because I don't want to, like, spoil it or nothing. But I have not had it for, for the record, ladies and gentlemen. When I saw it finally in Chicago, I kept making a mental note like I'm a grab. I haven't seen it for about, like, like, the past two months. So now I finally grabbed the bottle. This is the 91 proof version. There was two of them there, y'all. And I don't remember what the difference in, it, in them were. But uh, this one is made in Chattanooga, t uh, Tennessee. Obviously. Uh, Tennessee high malt is our rich malt forward approach to bourbon made from the finest malted grains. Each step of our, of our process has been crafted to highlight the complexity of these ingredients. Our signature Tennessee high malt recipe known to our distillers as barrel 91 was selected from the first 100 barrels produced at our experimental distillery. We hope you enjoy it as much as we do. So it's kind of like the, COVID vaccine. vaccine. <laughs> it's experimental. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, today my doctor was like, really, you got to get that vaccine. I was really, I don't. I don't. Really, I don't. He said, well, what if this? What if that? I just pushed back on it. He's like, all right. 
He looked at me. You, you know how when you try to sell somebody something for their own good and they don't listen, you just be like, all right, nigga. You know <laughs> That's the look he gave. Like, you know, do you then? Shanice, welcome to it. So tree. What up, Nate? Ninja? What's to it? Who that? Uh, Aside. That's Coco. Oh, okay. Coco hey, Coco, Sire. what's happening? The Black that's Shaolin. Southern University Coco. Oh, okay. That's Coco, Coco. I know so many Cocos. What's up, Coco? How you doing? Uh, who else did I see on here? Oh, uh, Shamil. What's happening, baby? What's going on? Um, let's get to it. You broke it? Yeah, broke it down real fast. Well, I broke down the... Uh, I didn't bust the seal on it yet. If y'all got any questions, we read as many comments as possible. If we miss it, Hell, you know when we miss team. Leon. What's up, brother? Swoop, swoop. Leon, what up, my bro? Coco finally made it. She's been trying to catch us for weeks and have has not been able to do it. What up, Keisha? This is definitely childproof. So if you got a bad yeah, teenager in the house, y'all, <laughs> get this one. He ain't no way to break this seal easily. I went to my homegirl crib. And she like, you got a drink? She said, yeah. She brought me out some uh some tequila. And I poured me one and took a drink. I was like, this been replaced with water. <laughs> she got teenagers. <laughs> I said, you didn't talk to your kids. This shit right here. Get your kids. Right. <laughs> they been in your stash, baby. <laughs> Watered it down. Huh? Okay. Still a light little snail. Kinda, nice little. Kind of wood. Give, gives me some wood and grass. It gives me the woods in general. <laughs> Try to set this here. Can y'all hear us okay? Yeah, I got the mic right here. So we, right. we should be good okay, in here. Yeah. So anyway, the nose on it is... Reminds me of outdoors. Don't smell like outside, but it definitely right. smells like say, outdoors. Not like a kid. Like, mm. Come in the house thinking. No, Dr. D came through earlier smelling like outdoors. She had been in the garden all day. I was like, oh, yeah, like uh, you have to so take two cool. steps back. <laughs> Checking out the playoff. Nets are losing about 13. Who are they playing? They playing um Milwaukee? I don't really follow it either yeah, too I, much. I was like, I will really watch ask me. <laughs> so yeah, it gives me the woods. It's, it's, you, uh, it's, you get some of the grass. You get some 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 wood. I'm getting like like tree bark. Yeah, wood that that type of yeah, not yeah, like yeah. cut wood. Cut wood smells so good. It's though. different, yeah. But it's not like that. Just black Shaolin. Welcome to it, brethren. Hmm. That's all I get. I, I, I'm, I get I'm still trying to get something else off yeah. the nose. Not so far. If any of y'all have ever tried this, let us know what your uh, how opinion you has about been. It. Yeah. Hey, I'll be out of Facebook jail, I think, in three days, too. <laughs> and you'll be back in in four. Man, look, y'all. <laughs> Mark This Zuckerberg. shit so, so, look, Mark Zuckerberg, I'm cussing him clean the fuck out when I see him. I swear, y'all. <laughs> On sight. On sight. On sight, I'm like, I'm going to make that motherfucker cry. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make him cry. <laughs> so first tip, y'all. Uh, if you if you watch it for the first time, we do three rounds. The first round we we sip take uh, two sips straight. Second round we do it on water with a milliliter of water in in this amount, so it's less than a shot really. Um, and then we do it on ice. Each round we can get very different characteristics in that particular bourbon depending on what force we put in there, whether it's the is straight water or ice, which is why we do all three, so we can give you a solid opinion on how we feel about it as it right, goes right. down. Janice, Janice, welcome to hey, it. Hey, Janice, what's going on? Um, so hey, boo. here we are with the first. He did his first. I had my little try. Um, for me, it was it was it, it's it's, it's kind of rough. Not refined, not very refined. It didn't say on here how long it's been aged. At least I didn't see it. But it is ninety-one proof. Yeah. I wouldn't think it would be this. This rough at night. I wouldn't say rough. It's a little, it's a little, it's a little heated in the throat. It gives you some business. Yeah, 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 yeah. A little bit. But I wouldn't say oh, rough. Two years, uh, age greater than two years is what it said. It tastes like it has to be greater than two years. So if it's a yeah, bourbon, yeah, yeah. So that, ain't, so that ain't saying nothing. Includes three select specialty malts. That's what I'm tasting. The malt, the malt for a distinctly rich and complex character. It's kind of like a rock. It's spicy, spicy like a rock. I don't think that's not spice, I wouldn't say. It definitely got malted rye as the second ingredient. And then barley and barley. Ooh, man, I, I got to bring that other one. I got that spice. I got a I got a rye kind of spicy on it. I wouldn't say it's rough. It's not bad. The flavor's not bad. It's you really some wood for reserve. It's really sweet. Uh probably it would be over there. 
check. Jim, what's up, baby? Paliba. <laughs> Come on, spotlight. Cousin, what's happening? I put a, a AC in the window yesterday. Man, it was so hot up in there. In your crib? No, in her crib. Her AC. Who? Talib. Oh, Talib. She no, like no. it like that, though. Huh? Man, it was be boiling all the damn time. She's probably Blade. like, yeah, I need a sweater. <laughs> that pretty much. You all right now? Like, what up, Ricky? Man. What's up, brother? Good to see you, man. But she got an older one, so it blow really, really good. Okay. It worked like a charm, boy. My little new one I had at the crib, man, that just... It blow heat out. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? All right, anyway, sec second sip. Let's what I what I've noticed with a lot of the whiskeys, with a lot of the bourbons, the first sip kind of gets you acclimated. The yeah. second sip, no matter how harsh that first one was, that second Take is a, a lot out. easier. Yeah. Um, so that's what I that's what I encountered on 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 this. Um so that first one, it was rough. It got in the throat, and that spice was like, yeah, for me. Really on the, um, about mid palate is where it started happening. And you feel it right, I felt it right back here in the throat. You know what I, I it reminded me of just on that last sip? Gin. And I don't know nothing about gin, huh. y'all. I just know that I used to drink it when I was, before I should have been drinking. And I thought it was good, but I didn't know no better. It turns out Gene is like trash, and I'll never mess with it again. <laughs> but it reminded me of that just now with that last little sip. Raymond Anthony Thomas, uh, one of Chicago's uh, Chicago-based outstanding artists, oh, he's worldwide. He said he just got a bottle, uh, and he likes it. He digs the heat. I'm, I'm with you, uh, Ray, on this Crack one. It. I'm liking. I'm kind of liking the Crack heat. Didn't on didn't have it. a sip on his big boy. Right, let's see. Let's, let's get to the H2O. second. H2O. Yeah, I'll yeah, pour yeah. The water. I pour a drink. Grab the water. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, I'm grabbing the water. We're second going to the round. second round. Second round, y'all. As y'all know, we do three rounds. The first round, we do it straight, room temperature, neat, as it's called in the industry. Um, second round, we pour, pour some, and then we add a little uh, eyedropper of water, like one milliliter of water to it. Third round, which you'll see in a second, we'll uh, add uh, a ice. small piece of ice. So, like he said in the beginning, uh, each round, we may get some different characteristics on the flavor or even the nose. So we like to go at it. And, 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 and it's and ice it water. Is. It's super duper cold. Extra, extra. So it chills it down a little bit, dilutes it to the degree that one milliliter will do a dilution. Did you? Yeah. And then um, and then that's that's what you got. So if you like a little water in your bourbon. Depending some on people the, do. some people do. They uh, bourbon and water is a drink. But old head when I was, you know, years ago, like, yo, try it with a little water. And I was like, oh, okay. I got a cup of water on the side. He was like, no, put the water in there. The, the, oh. the, the, okay. So I got the little water. You don't have to wait no time. Josh, what's up? Oh, this GNA. Hey. <laughs> Look, Josh introduced Prophet Menzi. That's Josh. Josh introduced me to the one gen I can ever really, really dig. Uncle Val's. That's never some, heard of it. Ooh, it's some good. It's some oh, good yeah. stuff. All this G, G, uh, Look, man, uh, gin is hard. You should have seen me outside but. the Taco Bell down in Carbondale, Illinois. <laughs> Passed out in the. Uh, he was doing the bala. Uh, I was worse than that because because uh, you never flipped, got up. I flipped over the handrail, <laughs> leaving out of Taco Bell, <laughs> fell into the parking lot, and I laid there. I'm on my back, and I couldn't even turn to the. You know, turn my body over to vomit. I just had to turn my head. Uh, uh, Scummy. All of the white boys were like, ah! They started cheering. <laughs> I couldn't even give them the finger. You know what I'm saying? I was busted. I was so busted. White man. girl wasted. Wasted, bro. I was done for. So I said, I ain't had a drink of gin since then, y'all. We got Bala on over here on the Facebook. Bala! Bala, 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 Bala. Bala. No, we don't want to update right now. Why would they do that in the middle of the yeah. live? I hope they didn't That's affect probably anything. Mark Zuckerberg too. Do he own YouTube? <laughs> I'm not I'm blaming sure. him. For Katie all Andrews, welcome now. to the broadcast. I think KD, that's the first, up, first time watching. If you are watching on anything other than YouTube, you're watching us on Instagram, right? Or you're watching us on Facebook, right? Right. Tune in to the uh, YouTube page, like, subscribe, and share, share, share. This is where we are sure. every Tuesday. It's the Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. B O W D E N oh. is Bowden, the Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. Or real short, four, four B's. Four B's come through. All right. Uh, but we looking good on numbers, y'all happening. 
It's whiskey. What's up, famo? You damn right, man. You better it's get whiskey. on up in it. Yo, it's it's different with the water. It's market hold on, different. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, let, let, me, let me see what's happening. Put your tongue in it, oh man. <laughs> oh wow, that's a whole different yeah, drink. Ain't it? Ain't it? So the rough, the 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 uh uh uh. Who's it, that who said they got a bottle? Uh, Raymond Anthony Raymond, Thomas. Try it with a little water and tell me if you experience. B, thing. what's up? We drink what a chat. We we uh doing Chattanooga. Chattanooga, Chattanooga whiskey. Great bourbon. Swoop 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 swoop. Tennessee, swoop. y'all. Chattanooga, Tennessee. Um, it's gay. It's, it gave me. It's a fruit flavor on it now. I was gonna say pepperminty. It's got a peppermint on there yeah. too. I, I definitely yeah. I would, I, would, I would say a peppermint, but I got a fruit in there too, like a plum. Yep. That's a plum. Yeah. I can see a plum right now. Well, every time uh, I, uh, I see yeah. a, a plum. <laughs> Again, it's kind of mid palate that the flavor really kicks in on it. Yeah. It's much, uh, it's it's a, not as sweet as it was on the first. I don't, I don't believe. It brought the sweetness down a little bit, but it gives you the fruit. It gives you some peppermint. Um, and it's a little easier going. It's a little easier going down than it was uh, initially. Bakes, what's up, brah? It sounds what's better. What's people? <laughs> and before we get to the third round, I want to remind y'all that you want to sponsor a, a week, an episode of the Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. What up, Brandon Baker? And he said we sound better on YouTube than we did on Facebook. So perfect. Oh, okay. Fantastical. Cool. You know, we sound fine if you just upgrade, up, update that phone. Man, upgrade shut phone. your ass up, phone, man. man. I, I just had. I just updated the phone last night. They forced me the update. I mean, <laughs> get a new that F iPhone 4. It's a little bit dated, it, it man. It works, man. It works. You're not gonna text shame me up in here. I'm not trying to text shame you. I'm saying that you can get much better performance out of your <laughs> device <laughs> if you got one that was made in the last decade. That's all I'm mm. saying. That's not a shameful thing. Like this dude still got a a, a, a two TV <laughs> floor model with knobs on it. Nineteen inch <laughs> bitches, nineteen inch. You know what I'm saying, man? It's swole. Lamar, what up, Lamar? What's going on, brother? One of my old uh, Periscope folks. Shut up, Banks. Love it's to see y'all. It's a six. <laughs> like that's much better. <laughs> Golly, <laughs> look, we also doing a separate fundraiser. <laughs> Help Kahari upgrade his phone. We're gonna do a, a, a GoFundMe. I don't want to I'm sick of Apple. Every year they got a freaking new it's phone. You haven't bought one in 10 years though. Why but are you complaining? I had one since the two. I'm tired of them. Every time they and every time it's I upgrade, okay, it gets worse. It every doesn't. upgrade is worse. It doesn't. I start I stopped worrying about it. I started upgrading. I'm like, yo, it actually does work better now. Don't have all these glitches and crap. Upgrade the phone, you're gonna get better performance. You know when they started really getting decent when the FBI tried to make them do something and they tried had to act like they were super pro consumer uh, 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 protection protection. Yeah, you know free rights and uh, rights of free speech and all that shit, security. And they've been like going overboard to tell the FBI f you. <laughs> <laughs> they do well now, you know what I'm saying? Okay, yeah. not to say they ain't in bed with the FBI anyway, or low key. Apple bricks their but, old devices. What do what do you mean by bricks, Brandon? I know that's some old bricks. industry, some old industry uh jargon. I don't what is, what is that? Oh, yeah, yeah. Black yeah, to leave is six, and I'm six S. Thank you that. very much. And I ain't saying I, I didn't know that was you, uh Lamar. Seafood Black Shaolin. Lamar. That's a dope name. Seafood Lamar. All right, so yeah, I liked it better with a little little hint of water in there. It wasn't so rough. Yeah, it's a, it's really nice. The taste really was nice. cool, and and I hate gin. Sorry for the uh <laughs> the, the, gin, the hate. gin hate, <laughs> but it didn't it didn't hurt it. it. It reminded me of gin, but it didn't like taste like like yo. This tastes like gin. It wasn't that. It just had that reminiscent of it, and I can't describe it anymore. You know, any more than that. That's what I'm getting though. I'm also trying to stream on uh, Instagram. So if anybody knows how to use that platform, I don't. I'm terrible with it. Let me know. Prophet Menzi. That's Josh. Uh, leave Crapple. Come on over to the better side of the fate of the force. Uh, uh, <laughs> this OS updates basically make their older devices useless. B Baker. I hear what you're saying, man. Yeah, right. They do eventually. They try. Eventually.
I'm holding it out. I'm holding out. I'm holding out on this six. He, he on this. He, Leave he, crapple and come on to the. Let me ask. What crapple mean? As in apple is oh, crap. <laughs> Yo, um, so my brain only works. If anybody like out there is you got a figure phone, I really want to go to the black owned phone, y'all. I really want to know, but I need, I need rely. God damn, I need reliability. Displacement with the ice cube in it. Yeah, uh huh. That's what you always say. I need reliability on my phone. I can't, I can't be taking them chance. So if anybody got any knowledge on that figure phone, please share. Uh, please share with me because I, I want to know and. When I looked up the reviews, they ain't had no reviews in like a year. Hey, <laughs> I've never known anybody with one. So I'm concerned. Right. I don't know nobody, but it, it, it's a black owned phone company. So I'm not surprised. Um, yeah. But if we any of y'all checked it out, holla. Holla. At me. I got the ice in here, y'all. I don't want to take too long. iPhone oh, starts we to self destruct this. after a few years. Yeah, they do, Taliba. They, they really I, I, do. I, I, I used to say the same thing. Cause I used to see the problems like after the update, like oh why is doing this? They didn't do it before the update, but lately I haven't had any problems. I do updates and I don't have no issues. Mm. Now I don't have super old phones. I update mine every other phone. I don't get every one, but you don't get the every latest two, right. but Okay, I'll have this one. This is an eleven. I'm not getting the twelve, but I'll wait until the, when the thirteen or whatever the next one yeah, out because you know it's coming. Get it. Oh, it's already out. It's already there. Baker F I double G E. Our figure phone. It's a brother figure. that started. He he's got the satellites and everything, so he has the service and the Please. actual uh, hardware. What's up, Paris? Paris, What's up, man. Paris, you got to come on the show, man. Right. Stop holding out, brother. All right. Paris, so, hold out on everything. He ain't I know. I ain't, I ain't seen that cat in. Nobody has. <laughs> Paris got a wife that ain't seen him in weeks. <laughs> she like, what that nigga at? He be on his own thing. You always have a recent device, which is what they want you to do. Yeah. I mean, but it has recent features on, which is what I want. So that's what, you know, I go ahead and give me a decent device. Similar effect as the water. Yeah. I would Similar effect as the water. I like it a little chill. As chill as it is. I think it watered down too much. But it watered down. It, it may water it down just a little bit. And it's only 91 proof. So I don't even understand why. It's not like it's melting. I'm going to try to get it fast. real fast. I'm not going to let it melt. <laughs> and you know I can't get slapped. I got to pass tonight. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You're going to mess up. I already saw me and my wife two years ago by accident strolling in the streets. It was like <laughs> right. it was like running into Waldo. <laughs> Where's Waldo? <laughs> Every once in a while, you find that dude. It was like the golden ticket. I should have won a prize. I should have got some money for that. Right, right. Yeah. All right, there's a little I ice. I won't let it melt, melt down. That's nice. That's nice. But the first one I had where the cube melted like yours is, I didn't like it. It was too melted. So if you get you your sip real quick, in my opinion, y'all, it's going to be pretty decent. Um... SK and uh, KD, what's up, y'all? How y'all doing? Uh, welcome to anybody else that came through. Brandon, Taliba P, uh, uh, Prophet Menzi. Uh, uh, I got a little more mint off the ice. A little more minty mint? Little mint little, yeah, yeah, yeah. On the um, sides of the palate. On the sides of my tongue. That's where the mint like comes through. Interesting. I get but I like sides. this one. But I, it just, I, I do peep the mint, though. I do peep it. It's not bad. No, this is a decent one. It's not something I would be looking for. I wouldn't be checking for it, but it's not bad. If 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 we were to get together and I was on the bar, I would go for that. Not before a whole lot of others. I stuff. mean, but, you know, everybody ain't got a whole bunch of stuff either. If I want to be cool and order some shit that nobody else is ordering. I like it better than Woodford Reserve. That's what Black Guru said. Yeah. He said it's better than Woodford. Yeah. It's I definitely like better. I like it better than Woodford. Absolutely. I like Woodford because the Hands name down. sounds cool. The name does sound cool. I think that's why people order it so much. I don't have a Woodford Reserve. Right. Get your goof ass you know, out of here. Right there, you drink slits malt liquor. Get the hell out of here. Trash. It ain't trash. <laughs> Woodford Reserve is all right. It's all right. It's all right. But I like, I'm like. I'm, I'm liking this better. I'm going to give it a 7.5. Nah, I ain't going that high. I'm giving it a 7.5. I like it. It's drink. Um, no, I'm going to give it a 7. I'm about to say 5.5. Five. Five five? Yeah. That's low. I mean, I'm, I'm compared like to some stuff like that we average. gave with five five too. Mm-hmm. No, nah, this is way better than that. Come on, man. I'm, I, I, I want to be consistent. I'm gonna have to put. I'm gonna, I'm 
you know what? I'm, I'm this is my vow. I'm gonna have a I'm gonna have a uh, checklist done yeah. next week, so you cannot be cheating. Right, right, right. Stay with my consistency. Yeah. What if we get fired too? And we could do a grab. You know, we need us. We need some money. That's what we need. <laughs> So we could hire us a a, a, a a web artist that they could make us graphs of all of our uh, uh, recommendations and our, our um, ratings. Yeah, and we could put them. What were your zeros to four? Yeah, we need what somebody. We need people to be able to four find four and that. a half to sevens, and then that'd be dope. What Ooh. are your you know your group of that'd be real dope. and separate them by you know price point. Then you can kind of see like okay. Oh, I know how to do that stuff too. I don't want to do it, but I can. What up, Leroy? It takes, some, it takes some, some, some work and some effort. Excel. Yeah. Can you use the You can put it all on Excel sheet. You sure just, can. I haven't done that. And then that just do the sort. You sort it by price. You can sort it by. Excel is cold, number. really. If Excel is decent. Take yeah. some time to use it. Excel do the damn thing. What up, Sharnice? What's up, baby? Swoop, swoop. So tree. So, right, so, yeah. I go with the five. I, I thought. I'm going to let you bully me into the six. I'm, yeah, you got to give it a six. I'm going to go down. I'm going to say seven. Because I probably gave, I know I've given some stuff Ooh. seven five that I probably like better. Yeah, that's that's high. Vic, Biscotti, what's up, man? What it do? What it do? Short <laughs> So that's I, about it. Coco didn't make it. She Coco probably didn't show up. Back. She gonna show up out there. I'm gonna kick yeah. her ass out. And then she go right over there, y'all, and, and fight she that picture. Disrespecting my whole picture. You see that? I got on video she too. Did. You know I videoed. Her. She was real disrespectful <laughs> up in there. She fought the pitch. She did what I basically be wanting to do is throw she, stuff she at threw back. <laughs> she threw boxing gloves at it. it was, right. It was unnecessary. It was real unnecessary. We're going to have some guests next time, too. Yo, hey. so next week, next week we got coming the Wallace Brothers. Sean Wallace, a phenomenal producer and musician, uh, has done tons of musical direction for tons of people, including me uh, and his brother, who's, uh, I'm going to say what his brother does, but he's a fly guy. And uh, they're coming in here celebrating their Earth Day. So it'll be the Wallace Brothers with the Bowden Brothers next week. Um, happy Earth Day to my girl, Risa T, Taria. And um, yeah, that's what we're drinking. This is Chattanooga it. whiskey. And uh, the best safe travels to my sister, Larissa, who uh, passed yesterday. Oh, uh, wow. Man, yeah. That. she And she was, she was really a, a major figure in the Chicago uh, dance community very supportive super dope mm. fashionable fly sister condolences to the family y'all so yeah peace to all y'all and and everybody affected by her passing but safe oh. travels to her spirit where uh where she goes on her next journey she's gonna be good um and that's all i got well starting tomorrow y'all i'm taking me a quick trip down to houston real quick if y'all in the houston area i'll be in your city taking over uh, I'm actually going down there for some like firearms training. I'm gonna take a couple classes, kick it with some of my people. I hope I can get up with them. You know, I know some cats that live in Houston. Yeah, uh, some young ladies that live in Houston. Some people I, I I know and kick it with or talk to at least on social media. So uh, looking to have some fun before I go back to work because I've been off for two weeks, y'all. They call it now, like bring your ass back. <laughs> two to weeks? You've been out longer than two, two months. Weeks. My bad. Well, Not two saying. weeks. Two months. They want me back picking that cotton. So. Back to the fields. Um, this last trip, and I'm out. Viscachi said he in Dallas. He going to Houston. Oh, word. Yeah, I'm going to be in Houston. Those are far apart, though. I think no, they're like, not. I, mean, I thought they were far apart. Too, like okay. two hours. Okay. Um, Viscachi, like two hours. I'm Disco Poet Gahari B. I am the indomitable Damani Bowden. This was the Bowden Brothers Bourbon Broadcast. Bowden Brothers Bourbon For B's, Broadcast. baby. Check us out. You can see all the episodes on YouTube, all well, the past awesome episodes episode on YouTube, and tune in to us live every Tuesday. I said six. Seven I said seven. I gave it a seven. He said six. It's what, what it is. Say? What y'all say? Check it out. Let Sit us with know us. in the comments. I'm going to try to put the bottle we're going to do next week up early. If you want to sponsor the dollar sign, Q-U-I-C-D-O-G. That's Q U I C D O G, quick dog. Q U I C D O G on Cash App. Hit that Let cash us know, app, y'all. Let us know what you want us to get. We'll grab or, it. Or just leave it to our discretion. We'll grab something we do at want the price point Louis that you 13. sponsor. <laughs> so if any of y'all, we will do it at the price point that you sponsor. Brian and uh, 3.5. Give you all the Creighton, shouts. What up, bro? Man, what up, Creighton? It's about What's time. On, um, so yes, yes, seven, seven ish, ish. <laughs> four hours. Oh, big, I didn't know it was that much. I uh, it was that's what I thought. Four hours, that's what I was gonna say. Okay. Uh, uh, Dr. D just told me that. So, um, 
That's our show. Tune in every Tuesday. We'll be back. Four bees, baby. Later, you. Peace. Ugh. Finish. Do the twist a little bit harder than you did. 66.